we have as a country a science, technology, and innovation policy, uh, which has just been uh, recently reviewed, and identifying the key areas that we need to look at. And um, as a ministry in charge of policy, we are quite on target, trying to get the key stakeholders together to come up with detailed action plans that or, and strategies that will lead to the implementation of the policy that has been uh, developed. I'm sure you reckon with me that when it comes to science and technology innovation, Ghana is lagging behind, extremely lagging behind. Um, are we concerned about moving along with the pace that, for instance, some West African countries are going. I can talk about countries even in the sub-region who perhaps are doing much more than we're doing um, as a country. I think we've identified these uh, challenges uh, associated with our efforts in science, technology and innovation in uh, areas like uh, when we, we come to human resource potential mm -hmm. in science and technology, we are far ahead. But in terms of investment, investment in research facilities and uh, research works, the budget allocation is quite um, small uh, compared to the, the average that the African Union has uh, set out as a standard of 1% uh, of GDP we are around 0.3% of GDP of uh, investment in uh, science, technology, and uh, research. So one of the key things we want to do as a ministry is to establish a national research foundation. We have quite a number of institutions, public institutions, private universities doing research, and. Uh, Ghana is quite uh, ranked uh, quite high in that, but the investment in infrastructure mm -hmm. and research works is a, a challenge. All right. So, the National Research Foundation is that the basics we 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 intend to begin with uh, yes. to propel us. Yes, we have research institutions doing different things. Um, like there are research institutions in health, biotechnology, we have research institutions like uh, CSIR, we have uh, institutions like Ghana Atomic Energy Commission, and of course the universities, they have some research, uh, um, crops research, soil research and all that. But how are their efforts feeding into the national development strategy? How is it coordinated? We need a coordinating point, one to bring all the various activities to bear on socioeconomic development through the National Development Planning Commission. So one of the key things that this research foundation will do is to be the coordinating point. Two, uh, in research, you have to motivate the researchers to come out with new technologies by way of intellectual property rights. The, the foundation will take care of that. Right. News Technology is sponsored by Cephline.